court comes as we see new daily infections in Florida surge. The state's weekly COVID-19 report is showing 45,000 infections this week. The positivity rate has also skyrocketed from 5% at the beginning of the month to 11% this week. And as we continue to see rising cases, Orange County Mayor Jerry Deming says he's looking at possible legal action to try to protect residents. News 6's Amanda Castro is in the newsroom with the latest tonight. We're expecting to get a COVID update from Orange County Mayor Jerry Demings tomorrow morning. This as we're learning he's considering taking action as the county is seeing an uptick in cases. It's not good news for Florida. Orange County Mayor Jerry Demings reacting to reports from the White House saying one in five of all COVID cases occurred in Florida. According to the latest data from the state health department, cases nearly doubled in a week. We see this pandemic, if you will, within the pandemic, and it's within that group who are unvaccinated primarily. The mayor says he's looking into what legal authority he has to issue another emergency order as cases are on the rise. We're expecting a COVID update from him on Monday. This is what he told us last week. We'll see. We're not, I don't believe we're quite there at this point. Uh, but if the numbers worsen, if we get to a point where we see uh, we're overrunning our hospitals or, or we potentially could overrun our hospitals, then I'll have to take action. Hospitals are starting to see lots more cases. ICUs are running out of uh, resources. If you thought this was all in the rearview mirror, it's not. News 6 spoke to Dr. Francis Collins, the director of the National Institutes of Health, last week. He's encouraging eligible people to get vaccinated, especially as we see a surge of the Delta variant across the nation. If there was ever a time to try to deal with this with vaccinations, because uh, that will make you immune, this is it. Deming says right now his focus is on getting shots in arms. He's also encouraging people to wear masks in crowded indoor spaces, even if fully vaccinated adding he's looking into all of his options as the county tries to get a handle on this situation. We can push these numbers back down so that we don't end up in some type of calamity by simply getting vaccinated. In Orange County, Amanda Castro getting results, News 6.